Isle of Man Food and Drink Festival this weekend. We've made it over to the Coffee Man stand. Unfortunately, Connor Cummins is not here this weekend because he is actually off island. But I'm here with another member of his staff, Phil Tier. Now you're the business um, development manager here, sales development manager um, for the island. Um, so what are you um, concentrating on at the moment? At the moment, there's, there's three main things to the business. As you can see, there's the Coffee Man brand. We have the coffee shop in Ramsey. Uh, we also supply all the machines to all the retailers and independents on the island. And we've also got the retail pack at the front of the, the store. So if you'd like to have a look at those, we're rolling them out to customers as well. And then the other side of it as well is all the merchandising to do with the Commons brand as well. And um, am I right in um, saying that I've seen actual Coffee Man coffee in the garages here? Yes, we do a lot of business with uh, the EVF petrol stations and as you can see the business model is replicated in all the stores and it seems to be working very very well and what you'll see as well is um, that will be replicated in other places in the island as well. And is there any plans to move off island with the brand or would you keep it all here on the Isle of Man and a, a bit more sort of unique? It, it was very interesting that uh, Connor did a poll on his Facebook page and he said where would you like uh, the next coffee shop to be? off island or in Douglas and I think it was a 76 percent of the people said they would like to have it in Douglas so we can't rule that out and uh, you know we, we would like to develop the uh, the coffee shops on island as well so it's pretty much sort of like watch this space and um, I am sort of like a coffee shop um, regular should we say Very and um, yeah. I, I do visit um, Connors quite a bit yeah. and one thing I must say actually is um, Connor himself is very good at sort of promoting his own business very good with his staff and actually being in the coffee shop as well um, and meeting and greeting the public isn't he? I, I think as a whole everyone knows what happened to Connor in 2010 mm. and he had a lot of time to actually think about another revenue idea and this is where the whole coffee man was born um, if you if you look at his flavour and the, the way that the, the coffee has been developed over this last five years, it is very, very good. And that's the consistency that we have in our coffee. And what we found is, this is why we're getting so much repeat business, is that it's the consistency in the brand. And what you say is it's, it's, it's because he's owner driver and he, he knows the staff, he knows the business. And you know, th this is where we're seeing the business grow and grow, which is really good. And if anyone wants to buy some of the Coffee Man coffee today, how yes. do they go about doing that? Just walk over there. Yeah, so, yeah they come up to your stand <laughs> yes. here. You're pretty much on the yeah. main walkway, aren't you? As you come through yeah. the um, doors, just carry on walking yeah. through and you're up there on the left. So you can buy, um, is it ground coffee you've got? Have we've, you got coffee beans? We, we have two, two brands at the front, of which one is 2010 and the other is called Racer. And there's a bean and a ground coffee in each. So there's four available packs and they're normally going out at 550 but we're doing a, a promo today two for tenner oh great fantastic i'll be buying some of those shortly fantastic. and um, i think um, that's nearly it because i think our coffees are up <laughs> so yes. thank you for supplying yeah, yeah. us with coffee this morning no bother absolute pleasure and have a very good show and you too enjoy the rest thank of the you. weekend thank you thank bye, -bye.